messy on the song. Y'all want me to? Nah, please. Come on now. Cut the bullshit. Please. Get a mop. Y'all being too messy and y'all being annoying. Everyone knows that Ice Spice likes to be messy, that she's always starting something, and that she throws shade at people. And that's exactly what she's doing here. She dropped a song where she called out Cardi B. You guys offset cheats on him like it's a full-time job because you tell me why he was just exposed for being in Ice Spice Diana's trying to link you all. As you would imagine, Cardi did not take this well. Everyone knows how it is when people try to get into her marriage and she hauled Ice Spice for filth, blasting her for being a hater. This Cardi B and expose offset for attempting to connect. Cardi also said clearly that she's going all in with Ice Spice. Does this imply that she will eventually record a diss track in the studio or will she be jumped? I won't get into that. Lie, I was taken aback when I discovered Dis Cardi because everyone seemed to think they were getting along well. Sure, they've had their share of problems in the past, but nothing too serious. It was just another example of fans playing the role of petty and inciting drama between the two women without any basis in reality. However, during her summer jam performance last year, Cardi was accused of acting shadily towards Ice Spice. Before the concert even began, there was an absurd amount of controversy surrounding her appearance. However, things only got worse for Ice Spice when it was believed that Say was harassing her throughout her summer jam performance. A photo of Ice Spice appeared in the backdrop. The fact that the girl in the pictures was dressed identically to the one Ice Spice wore in her widely shared rap song was why many thought it was her. When Cardi sang this song the next day, it was also her verse. Additionally, the images at the back resemble Ice Spies. Get set, New York Music City, U Music T, whose name is Che. The fans interpreted this to suggest that she was disparaging Ice Spice, and it's easy to see why they would believe so given. It all stems back to the Nicki Minaj versus Cardi controversy. Ice Spice had Nikki's backing at the time because Nikki signed her, dubbed her the print of rap, and even collaborated with her on a song. Conversely, when Ice Spice collaborated with Lotto on a song, many thought it was a diss track against Nikki, so it wasn't difficult to make the connection. However, Cardi received a lot of backlash for her shady behavior, and Ice Spice unexpectedly received comments like, even though it's super, Cardi B put a caricature of Ice Spice on her set in the outfit she wore on an Instagram story when she was rapping Tomorrow 2 and singing Annie before transitioning into Tomorrow 2, shading a girl that showed nothing but love to you. It quickly became apparent that it was a big misunderstanding because there was no drama in the first place. It's obvious now that Cardi B is shading Ice Spice but she will still come here and pretend she's not because she's a coward. Put the card's images where the little orphan was shown. Annie from the movie Tomorrow, Tomorrow, I Love You was performing those images because she planned to sing Tomorrow as a lead-in to her gorilla. Because of her orange hair, Ice Spice has often been compared to Little or Fanani, so I can see why some people thought Cardi was attempting to discredit her. However, Cardi quickly clarified that she, and this was still after Nikki began to show love for Ice Spice. Hardy hasn't suddenly changed her attitude and started disparaging Ice Spice because she received Nikki's approval. Instead, it has been love from her end. I think it's fantastic that Ice Spice came out to set the record straight before animosity between the two parties intensified and led to another rap feud, but, you probably think Ice Spice is shading Cardi because she's spending a lot of time with Nicki Minaj, but let's be honest for a second. That's not the whole story. The truth is that Nicki and Ice Spice aren't even on good terms anymore. They had an entire fallout after Ice's friend called her out for being untrue about her love for Nicki. Unfortunately, Ice Spice won't give Cardi the same grace that Cardi offered her. 
I asked you why you feel comfortable calling me a Mexican. Then Gerald Jerome Zozalana and I are Dominicans, and you don't do that to them. Cardi tweeted, After the drama, Nikki and the Barbs cut ties with Ice Spice. She secretly hated her, so her shade at Cardi wasn't about Nikki. The wild part about all this is that just a few weeks ago, Ice Spice and Cardi B were all buddy buddies. Then Cardi had beef with influencer Raymond, believing he was throwing shade at her heritage. I feel hurt because you know how others have wounded me. I asked why he felt so comfortable calling me Mexican. My mom is named Trini, and she came out of a whole black woman. My father is Dominican. I'm Dominican, just like you. I spiced up, no offense B. It's because I have a Dominican and a black parent. However, Cardi said she meant no harm, saying, I think there might be some confusion on what was said. I'd like to use other Dominicans as an example, as you should be aware that we frequently become grouped together due to language barriers. Additionally, please send me the photo you took of me from Vanity Fair using your camera. Ice Spice then posted pictures of herself and Cardi at the event, leaving us to believe everything was fine again. However, Ice Spice then abruptly released a diss track directed at CI, revealing a plot twist that shocked us all. She never said in her song, BV Belt, that he got to be, but he knows I won't tell I'm wrong, so ask how she felt I'm a terrible, like, ask how you feel. And I'm thick, cause I don't get a waist, think she pretty, but changing her face, falling behind, like we pick up your pace, it was funny. Until I took place, she continued her man calling, but I will be like, who this I'm switchy be, I do this light skin, but I'm black, you can tell about my hair. It doesn't take a detective to figure out that she was trying to discredit Cardi. After all, it was only a few days ago that she had a falling out with influencer Paradise Paris, who made fun of her for having plastic surgery on her face and body. Marty defended her love of surgery, saying that she does it out of love when she gets it, not because she's a ninja. The appearance of the vixen you bees always want to bring up a guy for a drag since you can't drag anything else. And it's not a joke because ninjas are waiting in my direct message. I got my ass off my soft ass titties previously. You spoke about me and now you're upset because your stomach looks like a wedding cake. She also said that you talk about hard ass titties, which never gave hard, and that you're shaped like a gummy bear or a Flintstone vampire. You're ashamed and it would be better to die on a table. The fact that you look like you and that part about her man calling was obviously about offset. Everyone knows he can't keep it in his pants. And not too long ago, he was exposed for getting his side chick pregnant. Given his history of cheating, nobody would be surprised if this tea turned out to be entirely accurate. But Cardi did not take the rumor well and lost it on Ice Spice. Claiming that these bees are completely insane, I am slowly but surely gaining my legs back on my album but your bees don't see me in terms of money or status. You have much too much time to catch up. I'm not in a rap race with any of you bees. And Ima shows you all that Marty is completely over people criticizing her for her marriage, her record and her surgeries. Can't see me in real estate fashion and can't see me in person. Fans are speculating that Ice Spice is trying to pull me up. Remember how wild the internet got when Megan dropped HS earlier this year? She threw shade at Nikki Minaj, and Nikki spiraled on social media. The drama propelled Ed to a number one debut on the Billboard Hot 100. Ice Spice has so many haters these days, and she's just done with it. Fans have been saying, Ice Spice can't rap, but she ain't scared to diss nobody. Yet she's trying to do the same thing with Cardi B, isn't she? These are the two things that can get under her skin the most. Notice how Ice Spice usually starts beef with other female rappers to rescue her career first, Lada being the first. This is why Ice Spice is so messy. What did Carissa do to her? 
while Lotto did nothing at all. Now all that Cardicardi does is get pregnant and whine on Twitter, girl. You're letting girls down, and now they all believe that you and Ice Spice Sub are on the same team. Ice Spice Sub shouldn't be getting you all up. I need to know your thoughts. Are you guys on Team Ice Spice or Team Cardi? I hope a bar hits you next just for the Rob 49 feature. Comment below with your ideas and then watch the following video.